Hello, Tass, Bluebird 18 Bravo is ready for departure. Bluebird 18 Bravo, Roger, Bermuda Tower. Wind 060 degrees at 09 knots, runway 12, clear for takeoff. Clear for takeoff, Bluebird 18 Bravo. Bluebird 18 Bravo, Bermuda Tower, cancel takeoff clearance, cancel takeoff clearance. Uh, we received some information regarding a bomb threat. Okay, cancel takeoff clearance, Speedbird 18 Bravo, and um, would you like us to leave the runway? Speedbird 18 Bravo, negative, all position, standby. Yeah. Uh, Speedbird 18 Bravo, you got any further information for us? Speedbird 18 Bravo, uh, I was just on the phone with the airport duty officer and they reported that they received an email saying that there is a bomb on board and we are currently working on getting the authorities out and getting you to an isolated area to disembark, possibly. Okay, that's understood, thanks. Tower Speedbird 18 Bravo. Speedbird 1A Bravo, Bermuda Tower. Yeah, I think we need to get off the runway here. Speedbird 1A Bravo, I agree. However, our isolated area, we have a C-17, which is apron 7. So um, the powers that be are trying to figure it out right now. Stand by. I'm getting another call. Stand by. Uh, Tower Speedbird 1A Bravo, this is a credible bomb threat. We need these passengers off this aeroplane. So stand 7 is our best option. Bravo, Roger. Let me call the ADU and uh, clear that for you. Hold on. Speedbird 1A Bravo, uh, taxi along the active radiate right Foxtrot to apron 6. Uh, that is the isolated area, apron 6, and stand by for the instructions. Uh, Speedbird uh, 1A Bravo, say again for the benefit of the captain is on the other uh, comm. Speedbird 1A Bravo, Roger. See along the active, vacate right, Foxtrot to apron six. That is the isolated area and hold for further instructions. They are arranging uh, some buses. Okay, and have you got steps in place? Uh, not yet. You need to be quick with this. I understand. And Speedbird uh, one. 1-5 Bravo, uh, have we got some marshals, please, on the stand? Seabird 1-8 e Bravo, uh, we are arranging marshals at this time. We're calling for them. Seabird 1-8 e Bravo, hold position until your marshals arrive. Okay, 1-8 Bravo, what's the, the step situation? Seabird 1-8 e Bravo, the steps and the marshals should arrive soon. Okay, thank you. And Tower, any updates? How long is this, this going to take? Uh, Speedbird 1A Bravo, I just got word from the Marshallers. They said they are on their way right now, and I am calling at this moment to find out about the buses. Okay, and uh, I would like full emergency services, please, fire engines, and as many ground staff out here as possible to help with the passengers. Speedbird 1A Bravo, Roger, noted. I have already advised the fire department, and they would be uh, they would be there as soon as the marshalers put you on a gate position. Uh, Bermuda Tower, Speedbird 1A Bravo. Speedbird 1A Bravo, Bermuda Tower. Yeah, any more information on the steps and buses, how many people are going to be here to help passengers off, etc.? Speedbird, Speedbird 1A Bravo, uh, my apologies. We are working on it. Apparently, there's also a bomb threat uh, for the terminal building, so they are in the process of evacuating the terminal as well. Um, I am working on it from where I am because everyone seems to be um, evacuating over there. So. The fire department is aware and the police are aware, and I believe that they are on their way. I also spoke with the handlers, and they told me that they are also on their way with stairs and the marshaller to get you into a position. Um, stand by for further information. 
Okay, that's understood. So to confirm, there's been a bomb threat against the terminal building as well, uh, and you're evacuating the terminal building, but there are steps and um, people on the way to us now. Speed with one, Bravo, e firm. And you don't have a time for that? No, I don't. The last time I spoke with them, they said they were on their way. So hopefully it's soon. I can give them a call back. I'll give them a call back in a few minutes just to find out. Where are they coming from out of interest, uh, Steve? I want it, probably. I'm hoping it was from the terminal building. Um, stand by, I'm getting a call. Stand by. Yeah, three, one, five, eight. Speedbird 1A Bravo Bermuda Tower, I just received an update from the uh, steps. He said the drive is approximately uh, two zero minutes away. However, as soon as we get here, we'll get you guys off and just have someone escort you across the runway to apron 3. Okay, so it's 40 minutes now since uh, you gave us the bomb threat. We really should have fire engines surrounding the aircraft, and uh, if it goes on for much longer, we will have to evacuate fire supplies. A speed with one in Bravo, I understand, and I am trying my best from over here because the, the terminal building is also being evacuated. I spoke with uh, the fire department, and they told me their protocol is to stay as far away from the aircraft as possible until it's cleared by the police bomb crew. So um, they are on standby, and if you guys do the rapid exit, um, we will have the fire department escort you to the across the runway away from the aircraft. So where are they at the moment? Are they behind the aircraft? The fire department are, I don't know if you can see where the air traffic control tower is. They're below the air traffic control tower in the vicinity of taxiway Echo. Okay, no, you're right. We're pointed at the terminal building, obviously, So, and there's no way of turning this aircraft around. So, um, no, we can't see them. Okay, Roger. Um, based on the fire, the fire officers are on standby at the station, which is just off Taxiway Alpha, uh, in the vicinity of Taxiway Echo. Okay, understood. Okay, so uh, Speedbird 1A Bravo, the fire department advised that they will just come out so that you can see that they're there. However, their protocol is not to come close to the aircraft. Okay, tower. So, Speedbird uh, 18 Bravo, uh, Mayday, Mayday, Mayday. Uh, once the passengers are off the aeroplane, we will un assemble them under the port wing of the RAF C-17. Understood? Speedbird 18 Bravo, Roger, Mayday, and confirm, just for confirmation, you are going to exit the aircraft. Next, if we, at this moment in time, we'll wait for steps, but if they take much longer, we will be uh, using the slides. Speedbird 1A Bravo, Roger, understand you'll be using the slides under the port wing, Roger. No, we'll assemble the passengers under the port wing of the C-17 RAF aircraft. Roger, you will assemble the passengers under the port wing of the C-17, understood. And uh, further to that, we will need ambulances now as well, please. Stephen, one Bravo, understood you are requesting ambulances as well. Yes, please. Roger. Speedbird 1A Bravo, I just got off the phone with the person driving the stairs. They're coming down taxiway Bravo and the runway at this time to the aircraft. Okay, tell them to come to door one left. One left. Door one left, understood. Tower Speedbird uh, 1A Bravo. Speedbird 1A Bravo, Bermuda Tower. Okay, so uh, we're about to give you the, the souls on board. Um, uh, we'd like to change the door, if possible, to door two left. Two left will be the best for disembarkation because of the layout of the passengers on board. And how many uh, staff will you have on the apron to uh, help us with crowd control? Speedbird 1A Bravo, Roger, door two left, and go ahead with souls, if you will. On board. Okay, there's a hunt. 
There are 197 people on the aircraft, 197, and there's 50 tons of aviation fuel. Speedbird 1 Bravo, roger, 197 persons on board and 50 tons of fuel on board, roger. Speedbird 1 Bravo, Bermuda Tower. Go ahead. Speedbird 1 Bravo, a second set of stairs are on the way, which would be the most appropriate door to send those stairs to. Yeah, uh, door 4 left, please, 4 left. Roger, copy. And how many staff are going to be on the apron to uh, look after the passengers? Stephen one Bravo, that is not something I can answer at this time. We have the entire fire department out on apron 3 and at the aircraft right now. And everyone from the terminal has been, has been evacuated. Okay, all right. Thank you. You're welcome. That's half the bird, 1-8 Bravo. Bravo, Bermuda Tower. Are the ambulances on their way? Bravo, there are ambulances on apron three and additional ones are on their way. So are they coming over to this side of the runway? They're coming out to where uh, the passengers are going to assemble after being evacuated. Okay, uh, stand by. That's our speedboat, one Bravo. Speedboat, one Bravo, Tower. Uh, how do you plan on getting these passengers to the other side of the runway? Have you got buses on the way? Speedway running Bravo are negative as they are going to be escorted by the fire department, so they are going to walk. And I assume that the ones with mobility issues will be placed in the fire vehicles. Okay, okay, stand by. And Speedway 18 Bravo. Speedbird 1 at Bravo Tower. We've got one wheelchair passenger that is going to require a high lift to disembark the aircraft. One wheelchair passenger requiring a airlift? Correction, a high lift, sorry. That's correct. Roger. And uh, yeah, we need, in addition to the high lift passenger, there's another wheelchair passenger as well. Speedbird 1 at Bravo, uh, my apologies sure. again. So we need a high lift for one passenger, and we also need another wheelchair for another passenger. Speedbird 1A Bravo, Roger. Noted.